Did you hear GOW3 alternate ending? Because of multiple directors, the game initially had different ideas about how the story of Kratos should conclude. David Jaffe's story suggests that in the first boss fight, Kratos would take on Zeus and end the god's life. And then, up on Olympus, a doorway opens from which the gods of Egypt and the Norse enter, and they struggle to control the world. The Titans and the gods of ancient Greece, Egypt, and Norse mythology engage in a bloody fight. In a boss battle, Kratos meets Theno and cuts off her head. Kratos later uses her head to turn the Sphinx into stone. Then he realizes that the only way to destroy a god is to destroy faith in gods among humans. Kratos could implement his plan without the gods noticing because they were busy ruling the world. When humanity ceased praying or honoring the gods, their strength diminished. Kratos and the Titans wiped off the last deities. He then slid his wrists with the blades of Athena, sending him back to the underworld to be with his family. Isn't it more exciting than the actual one?